don't know what's with that. I'm just gonna check him out for a second here. Hey. Oh, nice, man. Yeah. Cool. Look at those muzzles, man. Powerful step. Powerful step. <laughs> That's hilarious. I have never seen this guy here before. Looks like a different character model, too. He's got a different face. Hey. It's the power, the powerful step. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and he's got like skinny legs and skinny arms. <laughs> it's like some kind of shorts over, I don't know what they are, pants or something? Because it looks like his legs, but he's got like, that's got a stripe down them, so. That's got to be some kind of like leggings with shorts over them or something. The powerful step man. He's like the Flash or something. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. All right. <laughs> awesome. Too bad we gotta switch seats just for me to bring it in. <laughs> All right. Hello there, everybody. Welcome back. I'm the Missing Sock. Welcome back from our Grand Theft Auto Online. And today we're gonna run the mission known as Mole Hunt. In we go. Just like that. Hop in the truck and it just takes us right in. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, Mole Hunt is otherwise known as the gun running mission number six, but it really doesn't have to be done in any order. You just have to do enough um, uh, manual resupply missions. Instead of buying supplies for your bunker, you have to do the manual resupply. So you need 12 resupplies to unlock the mission. And then you can uh, unlock Mole Hunt. Yeah. So we're going to go do that. Good, uh, with the help from our good friend Tesserath here. Tesserath. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Awesome. All right. So let's head into the MOC. So you need one of the trucks, unfortunately. One of the uh, mobile operations centers. And then from there you hop in the back. Uh, enter in. Yep. And then once you're inside, we'll head over to the uh, mobile operations center. Um, over this way, mobile operations center uh, keypad right here. There we go. Press E to access mobile operations. Logging in. All right, and there's our mole hunt. All right, now, they don't really have a big payout for these missions, unless there's some kind of special or something for that week. Um, but the main reason why you would want to run these missions is to unlock the better price for a lot of the vehicles. And in this case, Mole Hunt unlocks the better price for the Deglassi, weaponized Deglassi Tampa. Yeah, we want one of those, so we're going to get one too. So if you don't do this mission, the, this particular car costs you 2108000 And after you run this mission, it should cost us $1,585,000. So this running this particular mission saves you um, just over five hundred thousand. So it's well worth it. All right. Are you sure you'd like to launch the mission? Confirm. Here we go. Mole hunting. <laughs> uh, let's change it to hard. And oh, yeah. Purchase all ammo. Why not? Uh, we're equipped. We're ready to go. Confirm. And we're launching the session. All right, so this particular mission, you um, none of these missions you can run solo, so you do need at least a second player. But I think you can run it with up to four players. And a lot of people really like the weaponized Tampa. It's a lot of fun. All right, there's our car. We're mole hunting. cars. That's a green one. And a gray one. States. Yeah, it's 2017. I can't believe it either. He's using our own facilities to down the network and cover his escape. We're allocating you some lethal technology to stop that happening. The mobile jammers will have protection. Deal with the guard details, take out the jammers, and we'll be able to trace this mole. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. So here's our Tampa. So away we go. 
And let's see if we can change the weapons. So I'm using our mouse wheel here at the moment, but there's different controls depending on what system you're on. Oh, I'm going to change my dual minigun. Nice. All right. So we can cycle through all the weapons. We're going to go hunt it down. So it gives us a few targets, only two when we're two players. So that's kind of nice. I think it gives you up to four targets, so there's only A and B. And I'm going to quickly check on our map here and set a GPS over to A. Now, just so you guys know, you can, um, you can just go on your own. You don't necessarily need to keep the team together for these missions. Oh, apparently we're going to go the other way. It's closer. Yeah, but you can also stay together, be rolling thunder like we are. So we're going to go hit these signal jammers. Apparently this one's mobile. Yeah, and then we should be able to track down the mole. From there, get them. And get our better price on one of these. Muscle weaponized Tampa. Very Mad Max car. <laughs> Let's give it a little test fire. <laughs> oh, here we go. Coming up on A. Looks like he's got an escort. Take that gun. Catch up to B. Let's try it right. I gotta just quickly check them out. See how far away B has gotten from us. Oh, no, it's a nice stationary one. So we'll just continue on and make a left up ahead. the rear mortar right now. <laughs> Go. It's a little weird firing the missiles. Probably a little dangerous too because the vehicles can't necessarily take a lot of explosions. Well, for these particular ones, none as far as I understand. So be careful with where you're firing the missiles. Start to be. I really do like these miniguns. <laughs> All right. Here we go, bad guys. Yeah, got okay, it. Nice. Jammers are down. Give us a minute while our servers refresh. Okay. Systems are tracing him now. <laughs> oh. Go to the meeting point. Alright. So yeah, so even if you do separate in this particular mission with all your friends, um, or whoever is helping you, you do have to go back to the meeting point anyway before it lets you go on to the next stage. So we're going to just head over here, very close by. Right in this very lot. We've narrowed it down to an area in the city. Search the location, find the mole, and take him out. Now we're going down to Elysium Island. Take that way. <laughs> I think we're taking this way, yeah. And 
a nice looking car. Though it doesn't obviously have complete bulletproof protection. Yeah, I think I took the wrong turn. Well, I guess I could have just kept on going. But it does have some armored protection, but uh, not as good as something like a Kruma or something like that. But things like Krumas don't have guns on the top and rear mortars. <laughs> <laughs> Deadly. That she performs really well, too. For a battle ready car. the hiding place of the mole's friends. Maybe you see that these are some of the guys that helps them know where we are all the time. <laughs> <laughs> All right, where's more bad guys? Oh, it's getting away. Oh boy, he's got one of our weapons. Take care, the target is armed, heavily armed. Don't let him destroy our vehicle. So, we don't have to kill these guys, we just have to hunt down that mole. Apparently, so that's good. Just gotta get to the right point where you trigger it. And then we chase them down. Whoa. <laughs> Not bad. This is my first time in the weaponized Tampa. Oh, he's got support. Just so much fun killing those guys. <laughs> Look out, he's got backup. You don't say. <laughs> It's okay, we're getting ahead. Oh my God. So we got the rogue agent bar down there. Looks like he's getting some hits. Excellent. Getting closer. Come up behind him. I got my Nendez. <laughs> That's right, I never liked my Nendez. <laughs> nice. Good job. Alright, taking this right. <laughs> Wrong 
wrong place, wrong time for her. Oh, oh I was following my GPS instead of the yellow line. Fun, if not a little haphazard and crazy. <laughs> All right, coming up to our left here. There's the cutoff out of the dirt road. Nice easy mission. It's too bad they don't let you do this one solo because you definitely could, but you can't. You have to have friends with you. Watch out for the telephone poles. Alright. Nice. Mission passed. So never, generally not the best payout. Usually just over 13,000 if you rush it. But uh, the main reason is that significant half million dollar discount on the weaponized Tampa. All right. Looks like they brought my B team van with me. <laughs> nice there we're getting. Hey, you know what? You did all right out there. Thanks. Now, if you want to try that again at home, the weaponized vehicle you used is at trade price on Warstock. Perfect. That's what I like to hear. All right. Thanks, Agent 14. <laughs> all right, everybody. Well, that is Mole Hunt, otherwise known as Mission Number 6. But like I said, you can do them in any order, as long as you've done enough resupply missions manually for your bunker. You can do uh, the missions in any order you want in order to get those discounts. All right. I think we'll check out our weaponized ammo now. <laughs> Coming up. All right, that's Molan. Thanks for Tesseract for helping. See you again next time, everybody. I'm missing Zach. See you next time. Bye bye. Take the B team van. <laughs> it's probably faster than a Lamborghini. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.